in this release of hyperlinks, we have enhancements in the field of serial channel verification. These updates are improvements in 3D area detection speed and reuse, additional protocols added for automotive high speed, improvements in 100 gigabit ethernet and OIF comm algorithms, and some fixes to existing protocols. Listed here in the slide are the additional ethernet protocols added for automotive high speed. Ethernet has added two, 100 megabit and 1000 megabit speeds. 100 base T1 is for the unshielded single twisted pair cables with 100 megabit per second speeds over distances of at least 15 meters. 1000 base T1 is for unshielded single twisted pair cables with 1000 megabit per second speeds in two types of link segments. Segment A supports up to four inline connectors for distances of at least 15 meters. Segment B, which is optional, supports four inline connectors for distances at least 40 meters. There are new protocols of the 800 gigabit eight lane protocol which are extensions of the 100 gigabit protocol. There is support for the backplanes, copper cable, chip-to-chip, -chip, and chip-to-module. Other improvements are the removal of TDR min and max impedance limits, which aren't required by the protocol. They were showing false failures leading to confusion on whether the channel passed or not. Additional improvements have been made to the 100 gigabit and OIF comm algorithms. In the Compliance Wizard engine for pass-fail analysis, frequency domain channel response information of the S parameters is converted to a time domain impulse response, and then sometimes converted to a pulse response, depending on the analysis. The IFFT function is used to convert from the frequency domain to the time domain. The sampling resolution in the time domain relates to the frequency range in the frequency domain. For example, for a bode rate of 80 gigahertz and 32 time samples per UI, the S parameters need a frequency up to 1.2 terahertz. This is unfeasible, so the improvements made to 100G and OIFCOM algorithms is the use of padding algorithms. Padding algorithms extrapolate the S parameter data in uniform sampling to the necessary high frequencies for IFFT while maintaining causality through exponential decrease. The compliance wizard now supports a new protocol for OIF 224 gigabit medium reach PAM4. Support for RX FFE algorithms found in MATLAB COM 4.1 is added to the 224 gigabit protocols by using the existing MMSE block. This protocol supports sweeping for RX FFE tap values. These values and results are shown in the HTML report in a table. Some smaller updates to other algorithms are listed below. An important note for PCIe 3, 4, 5, and 6 is the new adding cards and system boards for testing these protocols. Multiport package modeling has been removed for this release while it is updated. That about covers what's new in the field of serial channel verification in hyperlinks from Siemens EDA. These new improvements aim to lower the barriers of complexity and empower the user.